So it's absolutely typical, isn't it? The second you get solar panels hooked up, you get no sun. So you've got, you know, 0 0.2 of an amp coming in. No, 6.3 watts. It's basically dark outside at like 12 o'clock. So, uh, so what am I doing today? I'm just uh, making. I've got all this that I got for free. All these, all these bits of wood. So instead of buying wood to go around the windows, I'm cutting these down into these strips just with a skill saw, and then I use them around the windows. So I'm just going to cut these down. So I've got a load of strips, and then we'll start uh, nailing some of these on around the windows. Okay, I got some uh, some strips cut, so these are just going to kind of fit around the windows, like in there, and that will seal it off. I just want to get it sealed, really. So finishing stuff, I'm I'm concerned about doing that all at the end. I do all the little odd jobs at the end, outside bits and that stuff, and trying to get everything sealed off and everything in, so that I can be comfortable. Or we can be comfortable. It's just me here at the moment, but. Milena's coming here soon and I'd like it to be nice for when she's here so I'm just trying to get it sealed off and comfortable and you know all the things we need in here so we've got wood, power, seal up the windows <clears throat> you know then we can work on finishing the floor getting some units and stuff in and once all that stuff's in and it's all nice and comfortable in here I can do all the little outside jobs you know do around the windows and the outside and all that kind of stuff afterwards it's not important at the moment <clears throat> so that's what I'm doing now I'm just going to uh, clear the uh, the kitchen which is there and uh, and just start fitting those around the window okay so just measure this Let's see what we've got so 11 10 so cut a piece 11 10 put it there work the way around essentially okay there we are Nailed on. There we go. Just simple. There's no air coming through there now, so because it's a really tight fit. So that should do. Uh, I was going to put some like sealer or something, but it's windy day and I can't feel any any breeze coming through there at all. So I think I'll just leave it like that. Okay, got another side fitted. Nice and tight. Okay, that's a nice fit. Nice snug fit. So just get that nailed on. Then I just got to do a piece for the top, and that one is uh, is sealed from uh, from from the wind at least. And it should be a nice snug fit. Okay, there we go. All done. Sealed off all the way around. All nice and tight, and there's no wind blowing through there anymore. So, perfect. So for these ones here, where I have uh, have these logs on the top, there's not a flat area. I'm just using the uh, the piece of trim as a straight line, and then this is a low point, so I'm just going to have to trim a little bit off of here with a chainsaw until it lines up. So I'm just going to do that now. Not sure how well you can see that, but so you see I just shrimp, shrimp that, uh, that lower piece off. Went a little bit too far, there's a tiny bit of a gap, so I just uh, stuffed some cob in there, or some, some sheep's wool or something, just in there. But that's all right, that's good. It's, uh, it's all sealed up, just that one little bit. I can feel a bit of a breeze, so I'll stuff some kind of a filler in that little gap. So yeah, I've just uh, got to do the bottom one, which is easy, and then that's another window, another window seat. Okay, windows all done, just got to do the door, so see, this is the back window here. Just did the same thing, I just planed it down, this time with the plane, so I can get to it. Planed it down, and then a piece of wood sits nice on the top. And this door's actually got a, uh, a rubber trim on it, whereas a freezer door, so that seals up nice now. So no wind coming through there, so that's great. Okay, got the last one done, so that's good. 
sealed off. The only thing left to do now is the uh, is the gaps around the door because yeah, but I'm running out of daylight, so I might do that tomorrow. See, I got as you can see little gaps here and stuff, so I still need to do that. But yeah, I'm running out of daylight, so I'll probably just do that in the morning tomorrow. Uh, there's no through draft now, so it's going to be uh, quieter in here and uh, and warmer too. So when I get the fire going later, it'll be lovely and cosy. It was hot enough last night anyway, but I can run the fire much lower if, uh, if there's no draft coming through. Been pretty unlucky with the weather on this trip. I suppose it is winter, but uh, yeah, raining again. It's been raining for like three days now. Not a bit of sunlight, so still no solar. But I've got to run the generator today anyway to use power tools, so I just charge the batteries off of that while I'm using the tools. Um, so yeah, the aim of the game today is just to fit some more of these beams and finish off the joists for the floor. to the right angles to make them join up. Sorry it's so dark in here, it's just so it's dark everywhere. I mean it's just gloomy outside. So try and get a bit more light. So yeah just joining them up like that. Have to do that all the way along and on that side as well. So yeah that's just what I'm gonna do, go along doing them, screw them in and then uh, start fitting some floor. Okay got all the floor joists in. Uh, just going to extend the floor a little bit over that beam because that's all going to be covered by the units and stuff and it allows me to get to the uh, plumbing much easier so yeah I'm just going to have a little bit of a break a bit of lunch and then I'm going to start uh, putting some of these a few more bits of flooring along should have enough there for a couple of rows so get a little bit more flooring done just doing what I can do with what I've got so yeah, this is all on, it's all secure, it's all very strong. I can jump up and down and it doesn't really flex or anything, so that's good. So yeah, just uh, start adding a few more bits of floor into it. And um, we'll have a little uh, little bit extra floored area then, and this little bit less that I'm going to have to mill and do next time. So yeah, lunch and then I get on and do that. So it's, uh, it's getting dark now, so I'm going to call it a day. I've just uh, got another row of flooring on. See along there and I shall uh, fit the rest of that tomorrow. Should bring me out sort of here somewhere. So I've got a little bit, another 200 mil of floor space and you know this area here done so that's good, good. So tomorrow I just uh, carry on, get a few more rows fitted, probably relax the rest of the day because tomorrow's my last work day here so I'll probably just take it easy a little bit. So I get a little bit done, get the rest of that floor fitted because that will clear that area up as well. So. I'll show you that tomorrow. Alright, a bit of a nicer day today. You can actually see see in here now. Should be much better quality now. There's a bit of light in here. Um, the sun's actually out for the rest of the week. It's just been literally like in the clouds the whole time. So yeah, that's what I got done on the uh, on the floor in there. You can see it a bit better. A uh, bit, of, bit of sun just clearing the trees. So I've got a little bit of solar coming in. What we got here? Oh. So, 2 amps at 60 volts, so we got yeah, 50 watts coming in, not too bad, the sun hasn't really cleared the trees yet, so that's usable power for sure, 50 watts, wouldn't argue 50 watts. So what have we got done, we've got the, uh, the wood stove in, which is a really really great thing to have, it's been lovely and warm in here, even in the morning, it was 3 degrees last night and I woke up in the morning it was still, fire had gone out and it was still 17 in here so not too bad not too bad so we've got that done uh we've got the uh the frame around the floor done so the beams are in now i just need some more flooring i was gonna fit a couple more lengths but i have to go today because of some uh, unforeseen things so i have to just carry on next time i come back and um, we've got the solar hooked up <clears throat> and i just had a really nice time being here as well just really enjoyed it being warm makes a big difference so just really got to get this floor done now. I was going to mill some wood while I was here, but time was of a, of a, a bit of an issue, and 
Um, also, the uh, the weather was just so bad, and the lack of daylight. It's quite a long job milling wood, so the lack of daylight was a bit of a problem. So, <coughs> excuse me. So yeah, I'll be back uh, in two weeks' time to carry on with this floor, do some milling of some wood, and yeah, just enjoy the place really. Um, I'm going to mill some nice big fat pieces of wood for 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 the kitchen area and a, a desk at the back there and yeah so it's been it's been a good trip it's been nice shame i have to leave on the first nice day but I, you know i got some stuff done i wasn't working too hard i was just enjoying the place really um I'm not pushing myself too hard there's no need to i don't need to so yeah hope you enjoyed the video and thanks for watching and we'll be back at it in about two weeks time